It is 1 a 1 p.m. on the Thursday that the documentary documentary is due. Not documentary documentary. That was due half a semester ago. The original doc is due. I have not started. I have 11 hours to finish it. Let's see what happens. Before we start the project of the documentary, we need breakfast. Oh yeah, nothing like a good old campus dining breakfast. Pears and peaches <laughs> and a waffle. There may be some lucky charms soon. So, done getting breakfast. It is now two, which means nine hours, I think, to do the documentary documentary. So I'm getting ready to go to the library to finish that. So I'm gonna need a few things for the library. So here comes the Edgar Wright. Almonds. Edgar Wright done. That's gonna go in. Backpack on, we're ready to head to the library. Here we go. Made it to the library. Here is the setup for the day. Let's get to work. At this point, you're probably thinking, what's the big deal? You're just doing your documentary. Like, that's not a lot of conflict. Here's the issue, though. On top of trying to finish the documentary for the final in about nine and a half hours, I also have a lot of outstanding work for the class of nonfiction film and video. So I will be doing all of that within nine hours and then seeing if uh, Dr. Henson will give me credit for it. So that's the documentary. That's the conflict. Here we go. We're starting with the doc doc. That is the entirety of the doc doc. It's about 5, 36 seconds long. We are going to move to export now. One down, like five more to go. All right, so doc doc done. We're on to the archival footage edit. So for that, I've got Katrina talking about her time at camp. So let's hop into the edits for that. Update on the videos and editing everything. We've hit the point in the semester at Butter and Drone where I actually haven't shot any of the footage I want for it. So I now have to go shoot Butter and Drone footage, but that shouldn't be too hard, I don't think. It should be just about like five clips, I think, plus narration. So should be good. So here we go, it's a pretty day outside. The wind is blowing. Let's go see some Butter and Drone. All right, we've shot three things, one rolling a water bottle, one spitting out gum, and then one filling up the water bottle. So I'm gonna go get something from the vending machine and we're gonna throw it outside and that's gonna be like the third or fourth, fourth, and then we'll audit it together. Okay, we are here at the vending machines. And I 
think we're gonna get a bag of Doritos. That's one of four. And then we're gonna get 402. Some peanut butter M&M's. So by that approval and process, let's get the clip of the Doritos falling off. Delicious. And now for the M&M's. <laughs> or not the M&M's. Great. Thank you. Uh, there's like a, two rings. Uh, it's just like the library. Uh, whatever courtyard space. My plan is to cornhole these bag of M&M's into that ring right there. That is, that's the plan. Not very original, but here we go. I missed both, so not very good at cornhole it would seem, and I probably just broke a shit ton of M&M's, so time to eat them. Back here in the library, um, <clears throat> gonna settle in for a little snack break. Got my M&M's and a bag of Oreos, so we're gonna eat that real quick. Snack break is over and we are back to editing. So, hopping right back in. All right, I have finished every assignment for John Henson and commented on videos on As You Learn. If I remember, I'm showing you my computer with all the emails for me commenting right now. So, that's all of it. That's me. I've turned everything in and now I'm on to editing the original documentary story. So, See you in a bit. After I get most of it edited, I'm gonna email John Henson about credit for all the stuff I turned in today, and we'll see if my goal and my hope and my dream, my wild dream is complete and I get credit for the class. And if not, that's honestly not gonna be that great, but we'll see what happens, so stay tuned. In the dorm room here, don't have a hat on, just sitting by my computer. I was able to finish all of the doc, the original documentary, not doc, doc, that was done earlier today, but the documentary is done, except for it's email time to John Henson, and then we're going to await his response. I will probably go to the gym in the time that uh, it takes for him to respond, so I'm going to email him, and I will read you the email. Here we go. Real quick before we get to the email, I just wanted to show the full video here. My original documentary right now is running to be about, oh, wait, is running to be about, I think it's seven minutes and eight seconds long. Here we are, folks. This is the email. Time for some cinema verite as I read this email to you that I'm sending to Dr. John Henson. <clears throat> Dear Dr. John Henson, I hope the end of the semester is treating you well and you are looking forward to some summertime sunshine. I know what I'm about to ask is a lot and that I have no right to ask it of you, but I have submitted all the work that I had outstanding for your class and responded to others' work in the forums. I know throughout the semester that I did not submit a lot of work out of class. I ended up getting very busy with newspaper things and my capstone class. That being said, I hope that my work in class does not reflect what I got out of the class. I learned so much in the class and I hope that is reflected in the work I turned in today and in the original documentary. Could you take one extra look at the late work I submitted and consider giving me partial credit for the work I did? Thank you so much for all you did to teach us and even for considering this request. Best, Asher Davidson. And that is sent. So, fingers crossed, he is merciful and gracious in giving me partial credit. I've given it the time since the last video it's 11:51 now the video is due in like eight nine minutes so no response from john tonight uh if i do get one tomorrow i'll be sure to put it on the website page as well and upload it to youtube so that'll be the response if he gives me one uh either way i'll be sure to put it up tomorrow on the page so cheers